All right, guys, it's been about 10 minutes. Now, let's get this little it weather has. stripping. Yeah, it has. Okay. Oh, that looks much better than the way they had that mess. Yeah, buddy. All right. Next thing we're going to do is put on our wiper arms. We'll be right back. All right, guys, we're going to install our wiper arms with our new wiper blades because these wipers, how they were using this, I have no idea. Let's get those off right here. Got a little clip right there. Just push that clip down and slide that right out. Just like that. Let's get the other one off. And then let's get our new ones out the bag. And these, and just in case, these it's are... A, it's, huh? it's not a bag. It's a package. package, okay? See, now... Alright, let's get those out. And they're 21-inch blades. Alright? We'll be right back. Alright, guys. What we're going to do, you got your blade right here, wiper arm, wiper blade, pop that piece up, take the arm, put it in there like that, make sure it's back enough, and then lock that back down into place, alright, let's get this other one done. It's kind of messed up, guys, because our mark that we put there is gone. <laughs> so we're going to go where the mark is on the windshield. The dirty mark? Yeah. About right about there. Get that put on. Get the nut. Tighten that on. You want to make sure you see. I'm wiggling it and pushing it down at the same time to make sure I'm grabbing through those splines. All right, then let's go to the other one over here. That one looks like it's got a tiny bit of mark up there. new Bosch blades. I like this. Yeah, boy. Alright, let's go get our ratchet and we'll be right back. Alright guys, I got a 13 millimeter shallow socket, 3 inch drive, my 3 inch drive ratchet. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to hold my arm in place as well when I'm tightening this up. Alright, and I'll go till it stops and then just a little bit more. That's it. That one's done. Let's go over here and do this one. And be careful, guys. You don't want to drop this onto that windshield. Until it stops. And a little bit more. That is it. Last but not least, as I recall, one of them was missing. I should have got this from the junkyard. I got these little caps here. They just go up there and pop right into place. Alright, we'll be right back. Alright, guys. We got the... Uh, it's actually called a thermostat kit from Duralast. So, yeah, buddy. Just so the number is 5500 KT. Came with the, the therm a new housing. This is the old one. I already, we already got it on and all. Ain't no use in showing you how to put it on. New seal you and... already. What? Show them how to put it on. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I said, ain't no use in you put... Show them. Let me finish. Because we did it already. Sylvia, you... That didn't... was the thing. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. All right, guys. And... We're ready to install our little air pump here. But remember when we... Remember the, You're going to wet that up, right? No. Remember the bushings were all messed up? So this thing wasn't even holding together. You're so, check this out, guys. I didn't know they came... I didn't know you can get these. But you can get the uh, kit with it. I'm not even sure this is going to help you. But jot that down. Put in your memory. <laughs> yeah, buddy. All right. So what we're gonna do, 
let's get these off. We got three 10 millimeter bolts. So let's get my 10 millimeter deep. Get my cordless impact, and hopefully this is a buzz it right off without the back of it spinning. Cool. Go over here to our air pump, and these things just pull right up. One, one pulls right out, and number three. Yeah, buddy. Now let's get our new ones. They got the little opening in it, nowhere else on it, but right there. So put that down. That's one. Right here, number two, and right over here, number three. Okay, now our pump sits in about like that. This bracket sits in like that, so I believe we're going to be... What the heck? So, right there be it. Nah, nah, nah. Let's go back here. Let's go back here. Yeah, buddy. Like that. So, that's the way we're going to store it. Let's turn it over. Get our three 10 millimeter nuts. Let's put them on and then tighten them up. Alright? I'm not wiping that thing. Wipe it. No, I'm washing down the engine anyway. Ugh. Man, it's so difficult to be me. Is it? <laughs> All right. It's, it's Here. Wipe it down, nice. I'm going to wash the. I'm going to wash the whole engine down. You're not even going to notice you it. Do that for me. But I'm going to wash the whole engine down. I'm going to wash the whole engine down. Okay, but you're not going to be able to wash underneath. Yes, I am. Alright guys, we'll be right back. Alright guys, now these hoses. This hose is going to go right here, hook up right here on the air cleaner. This one right here is on that EGR or some kind of valve we want to call. I don't know if you want to call it the EGR valve. Way in the back. Right there. Now you saw when we disconnected it because this air cleaner was out and all. So, we got, let's take out our three 6mm bolts. One right here, one right here, and one down here behind this harness right there. We had, this, we had a hard time getting that one off before we hit it. This is taking a long time. This is what they this is what you do when you get paid hourly. <laughs> take you take forever taking a bolt out. Right, let's stop playing around here. We got our plug right here. So let's get our harness, the hoses, over there. Bring this down. And what we're gonna do here is take one of our bolts. Let's start it right in here, just to get this thing so it won't move around so much. Then while we're here, let's plug it up. Okay, then we're going to go over here, take this hose, push that until it clicks and pulls a click. What the heck is going on? Why is this thing clicking? Make sure it's in there good. Alright, then I gotta reach around. Hey, maybe I should have did that one first. Okay, where's that other one at? Here it is right here. And can you see down here?
Okay, that's on. Alright guys, let me get a socket and an extension and I'll be right back. Alright guys, now you can use a 6 inch uh, 3 8 drive extension. I I'm too lazy to go back to the truck and get it. So I'm using two 4 inch 3 8 drive, three eighths, uh, drive extensions. And this one right here is a wobble. But, it's, but if I push it all the way down, it's like a straight. And this is a little trick you want to do. Take a piece of plastic or something, or a piece of grass. Put piece the, of grass? Yeah, I used to always do that, man. And you just you want to put the bolt in there. So that way, you can hold it into place. And then you come over here. Now, our first bolt is right up under there. Follow. Alright. Let's see right there. And this is like, see right now this the housing is in my way, so I can't really screw this on right, but luckily I, my hands can get on this side. So I'm gonna take this off. This one is way down there. Can you see the hole? Yeah. yeah. So on that one, I'm going to be using the extension and all. Get another piece of plastic. Don't reuse. So it looks like it kind of sucks because now my housing in the way. So now we're done. You know what we're going to do, guys? If I can't get my hand down there to start that off, I'm going to have to get a swivel extension and try to get that. All right, so you know, let's, let's, let's even do that. All right, we'll be right back. All right, got my little sewer here. My thing, my tape broke. I usually I keep the tape around it to keep that in place. Hopefully, that's enough to go down here. Close. Dang it. So that's why I put tape on the thing. Blinding me with the light, Sylvia. You know what? Forget you. Trying to help your butt out. I don't for no help. Forget it then. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. See? See? Now you get nothing from me, though. Block that camera, didn't you say something? Really? Yeah. Really? That's where you put it. How you like that? Dang there it! You <laughs> Teach you what for. Yeah, this 
got to be the most suckiest. No, I lost it. I went to college. <laughs> 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 oh, look at my knife. Yeah. 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 I lost my spot trying to help you. I told you I had extra no help. All right. I don't All know right. why you would put the light back there. I got it. I got it started. You say, huh? Okay. All right, let me. I'm going to call this impact. I'm call this scratching. Let's see if I can. <laughs> Alright, let's get this out of here and tighten up the other two guys. Alright, we'll be right back. Alright guys, here we go. We coming down to the wire. We coming down to the end of this series. The battery. Fully charged battery. Uh, positives on this side. Maybe they can make these things. Right? Look at this man, look I got it. That's not a big hand. battery for this little car. Uh -huh. Thank you, sir. I wonder when you were going to help. <laughs> Come on! What the heck is... Get this huge battery in here. I don't know why they even put this huge battery in this little car. You could probably put a, a lawnmower battery in this and it'll work. What the deuce. Ah, okay. Let me see now. Put the battery up that way. Let's get our hold down right here. And our hold down goes down here. You can let that go, Sippy. Come on this side. We are almost ready. I'm looking forward to this. You can't put the battery back in. This is some bull. I'm not even sure if I got this thing the right way. It don't look right. What do you mean it don't look right? I'm just kidding. No, no, it actually don't look right. <laughs> oh, maybe I should take this watch off. All right, let's see here. Now, we're looking at this. It looks like the bolt went there. So that's definitely the way to put this thing. Why is this, like, always in my way? Yeah, because on the other side, it hooks up, hooks in on like a slot. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Okay. I'm trying to get this bolt down in there. Ugh. Man! Just because you, you wanted a beetle. Uh, wrong. socket and all you ain't tighten this up I'll be right back all right guys I got a 13 millimeter deep 3 8 drive with a 12 inch 3 8 drive extension I'll call this little driver tighten that down the battery is now secure the next thing we'll do our positive terminal is already ready to go so let's get that pushed down let's get our 10 millimeter Millimeter deep quarter inch drive, quarter inch drive ratchet. Get that tightened up. Put this down. And then we're going to do our negative. And then we're going to get ready to start it. Oh, I hear, the, I hear something sparking. Come on, don't, don't 
Don't give me a hard time. You got to be kidding me. Is that all the way down? Okay, that looks all the way down. Okay, let's get this tightened up and we'll be right back. All right, guys. <laughs> the Volkswagen key. Man, this is when your heart hits your drawers because you have no idea what's going to happen. Either you're going to celebrate or you're going to go into DEF CON 5. Now, this is look over everything. Everything is good. Everything is good. Oh, man, this is it, man. I hate this part right here. All right, you ready, Sivvy? Yep. All right, guys, here we go. Uh oh, first activate. Oh, look at this! Oh, look at that engine run! Oh, you know, usually I say if I if I muted it, you wouldn't tell us running. But Volkswagen, you didn't see that little did 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 Not really. I should hit the mute button. Y'all think y'all think I'm shaking the car? Hi. That sounds great. How does it sound, Cindy? Guys, look at that. Oh my goodness. Let's look at the back. Guys, there's no it ain't smoking. Let's, let's, get, let's get close to the tailpipe. Where's the tailpipe? Oh, it's over there on the other side. Let's listen to that sound. Because you know, if it's got a misfire, you guys can hear it. Oh my goodness, guys. Let's go back up to the car. Let's go back up to the car, Sydney. <laughs> oh my goodness, this thing. Look at the lights, man. This, this car is bad. Look at that engine. Totally different from how it ran a little while ago. Well, a little while ago. I'm going to say days ago. <laughs> guys, that is great. That is a great job. I got a Pat Civi on the back for that. She's my motivation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go away, guys. Let's let this run for a little while. Let it get warmed up. And uh, we'll be right back. All right, guys. It's been running for about a half hour now. This thing is great. It started, you know, a little bit shaking. But I'm going to chalk that up to a relearn. Because it just went, it only did that for about two seconds. And then it smoothed out. And look what we did. We went to the junkyard and we got a cover. We painted it. Civi put the 2.0 on it. We hooked that thing up. Whoops, we gotta take the thing out. It goes in there. But man, that's gonna look sweet. But we got one more special surprise for you guys. One more special surprise when we come back. All right, we'll be right back. All right, guys, here we are. Here's the special surprise. Did it. There's Civi. Uh oh, this is Civi's new car. No. <laughs> what a, that, that light. All right, guys, let's 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 get back here. Let's get back like this. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Now the, now the light ain't bad. All right. All right, Civi. Started. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me go over here. Look, look at look at that cover, guys. Yeah, buddy. <laughs>